Hello and welcome to Blockchain Gaming World with me, John Jordan. So uh, Ultra uh, is live. So Ultra is, uh, we can think of it as a sort of a Steam on the blockchain. It's actually um, a bit more than that, really. It's sort of Steam with some added uh, esports and with a uh, Twitch integration, and that's all on the blockchain. Um, so it's finally gone live. I don't think we really see anything sort of has changed. So I've been on the uh, the beta. Um, so up to that point, sort of certain people were allowed in. I think they had about a thousand people sort of testing it out, um, and now anyone can download it. It's a PC client, so it's just PC games. Um, so you need to run this. You have to do, like Steam. You have to download the uh, the Ultra client and set it up, um, and then you can uh, buy uh, games. And there's an NFT marketplace which we'll look at. So a whole bunch of games. Um, the vast majority, I think, the vast majority of these are just standard, what we, what I would call Web two games. So we see sort of standard prices for these sort of um, games. Um, the Web three stuff, I think, is coming. There are some Web three games, um, but they are um, the majority of the sort of the interesting stuff. I guess we'd say is coming later. Um, and it has to be said, I guess, um, I don't take any pleasure in this. That the majority of these games. <laughs> Of, of the games that are currently available at launch are, are not particularly interesting, um, I would say. So a lot of these are quite old games. You can see like Mike, Microids, you know, it's a well-known publisher, but not really, you, know, you can really say, doing AAA games, I mean, Flashback are very, um, you know, sort of well-known, but, um, you know, old. <laughs> I think we have to say 20 years, over 20 years old Flashback. Um, Lords of the Fallen um, is a, uh, you know, a highly regarded game. Um, but again, uh, five years old, I think. Although the price is pretty cheap on that one. Um, so, so, so to some degree, the problem the problem that, that uh, Ultra has to overcome is there's Steam and there's Epic Games and there's um, and there's um, GOG and there's all these other um, PC game distribution platforms that have existing audiences. Um, and how does it fit into those those things? So I think we'll see sort of over time how it does do that. Um, so one thing. Um, that it does have is its own NFT marketplace. So it calls NFTs for some particular reason uniques. So I guess it doesn't want to say things that NFTs. Um, so supposedly, I might have to have a look around here. There is a, um, maybe it was just yesterday actually, there was a um, um, an NFT you could mint, like a, like a, like a day one NFT. Um, I wonder if they've gone. <laughs> I have to look up. Um, let me let me stop this video and actually look up and find out how I can um, have a have to get one of those. Right. So I have found out how to do it now. So <clears throat> I have to go to my wallet. So Ultra, um, as well as I use that term for sort of the, the client, is also a blockchain. Um, so there is the Ultra blockchain, which is a um, originally was based on the EOS um, code base. I don't quite know how um, uh, how much they've changed it. But anyway, there's there's Ultra as a blockchain. And that also has its own token, so its own cryptocurrency, which is again called, um, it's actually called, um, the ticker for it is, is UOS. Um, so that, that stands for anything, but anyway. Um, so if you look at my wallet here, you can see I've, uh, I've got some, um, I've got uh, almost 12 uh, UOS tokens, and that's currently worth about three, well, about three dollars. Um, so, so these are tokens. It can be a little bit confusing. Some of these, you can get these tokens, they originally ran on Ethereum, so you get ERC20 versions of these um, tokens, but now this is the native token, you can transfer them over. Um, so there's my wallet address up here, same as like a public um, uh, address for Ethereum, uh, so EVM systems and my referral link. So if people, um, maybe I'll put that in the video and you can you can uh, download it with my referral link. I don't quite know what I get. And I can, if I wanted to, I can send some of my tokens to, um, to other wallets and um, but I, what I have here is a code to redeem so this was emailed to me um, I guess because I was one of the uh, early users of the system so we can use this code um, and next what's going to happen here is they're going to verify my code hopefully no one <laughs> no one will have used it but obviously this is a one-off code so you can't redeem that code That's just, there we go so um, uh, so this 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 unique this NFT has been uh, added so it's called all aboard no more soon Whatever that means. Um, so there we go. This is my NFT. Um, this is the so the unique has a number. On, so this is the sort of the um, the number of the collection, and this is the number that they put out, I guess. Um, so this is a cosmetic emblem of my uh, initiation into the ultra eco ecosystem. Um, so uh, this is a 
big mothership. Um, so I guess maybe if you if you download Ultra, you might get one of these as well, I suppose. Um, so this is number 1519. So there's been uh, 1,519 of these created. Um, and uh, what can we see here? I don't think there's any sort of gallery here. Um, okay, yeah, so more of these uniques can be created. So they just, it's not a fixed um, amount. So there's no quantity restriction, no time restriction. So I guess if you create a, a an account, you can do that. And if I wanted to here, I could now sell this on the marketplace. I could set a price. Obviously, these are not going to be valuable because everyone's going to get one. I guess the number one might be valuable, I suppose. Um, and we can see here, here's some other NFTs that I've collected over the um, the months. Um, so they were, they've done various NFT mints. Um, none of these, I don't think, are particularly valuable. There's this one here, which was a Christmas one. Um, so this is... Um, Number 1,390 of this uh, Christmas cyborg. Um, so we can again sort of see the properties. Um, so no more, oh, so max supply is 70. Okay, interesting. So that number, I don't know what that number means. So there's only 70 of those were created. So the maximum supply of 70, only 37 of those were minted and 33 haven't been minted yet. That's interesting. Um, so I don't know if any of these have been traded. They're not put in the data yet. So, um, but obviously that might be I don't know if any, anyone would want to would actually be interested in buying that. Um, 150 of these ones. These this was a um, um, I don't really know what way I got this one. An infinite pet. Um, so oh here it says yeah. So there's, it said 150, didn't it? So um, I've been reading these wrong. So this is the the factory number is the is the series, and then this is the unique number is 95 of 50. Um, so this one here was actually. 1330 yeah. um, and this one here was one that I was a sort of a, a test mint they did so there's I think 600 of these looks like yeah 600 of these ones and I've got number 556 and I've got actually another version of this um, number 222 of these so uh, that's what's going on with this at the moment um, so there's the obviously there's the uh, marketplace here so there are other things that, that so this one at the moment is a they're doing a mint out about these clothes so these are you know you can see this is in this is in pounds so um, fairly expensive if you want to buy a sort of jumpsuit combination thing you buy this in an nft and then you i think you burn the nft to get the actual sort of clothes um a lot of these ones now are sort of sold out so you can actually um, hide the sold out ones um, and just see the ones so these are i don't know what the gold one is it's sort of, sort of like a um well, we can actually have a look can't we um let's have a look it gives the details um so this provides physical and digital art with a um it's only 50 of these um oh it's interesting they have a minimum resale price so you can set the minimum price the minimum resale price so you, so you can't sell it for less than 70 percent interesting um and this one comes with a physical handcrafted artwork in 18 karat gold um and it sends anywhere in the world oh it gets early access to oh one triple a game um okay so people are you know whether that's worth anything probably not um, that amount of money and then so this is the launch pad where new nfts are created but we can also go to the marketplace and see um What's going on here? So this is a, a looks like a New Year one that was uh, airdropped to people. Probably um, we could probably have a look at low to high what the prices are. So we can see those ones we've seen before. So this is twenty five ultra tokens. So I can't remember what that would be. Not very much. Um, uh, someone's trying to sell their all aboard for thirty five ultra tokens. Um, so you can see a lot of people who've sort of been involved in the beta test are um, seeing if they can sell any of these out. Um, so there's all these, all these variations of droids. Which was sort of the uh, cheapest ones? What else was there? Is that about it, really, isn't it? Um, a little quick look. Uh, let's see if there's anything else that's interesting. At the moment, these were just sort of test ones. So there's, you know, I don't know, I don't know why anyone would spend um, money buying those unless you wanted a sort of collection of them. But um, I don't know for, for your own sake. I don't think they have any uh, particularly utility. Um, so obviously, some of these ones have this one. Um, okay, so so this one here is. Uh, holding this unique grants you access to Ultra Games before its public launch. This one actually has no, I mean, this just has no, no value at all now, apart from maybe um, people just want to collect stuff for its own sake. Just, I don't know, there's no reason to buy that one now. Um, this Ninja one, so see, some of these are sort of, you know, maybe from the artwork stand, standpoint, sort of nicer. How many of these are? So, um, so there's only 30 of those. Oh, no, um, 30 per account. 
Um, so it's 300 of those. Um, whether that gives it um, uh, any meaning. Um, no, I mean, obviously, maybe in the future, these could be characters in games. So I don't think there's any promise around that. So I've just literally made that up. <laughs> so please don't buy them. I'm thinking you're going to get into a game. Um, what are these New Year ones? So it's a final one to have a look at. Okay, so there were... Um, okay, 1,500 of these. Happy New Year. I don't know why I didn't get one. This felt received wrong. Um, oh, this is... So this was... Oh, this was 2000... Um, oh, no. I don't know. I should have got one of those. I, maybe. I don't know. Maybe I, was, I wasn't in the first wave, actually, of the of the testers. So maybe that's why I didn't didn't get that. Anyway, so Ultra is live, at least. That's the, that's the headline. That's what I'm struggling for. Um, some games here. Um, some of these... Oh, eSkills. That's a new one. eSkills Hub, uh, which is a... a um, Uh, it's a sort of, yeah, it's a betting um, thing, eSports, eSkills. Um, so you can play against other people. Um, there's actually one that I just thought was interesting. Uh, so it's, the stuff that's interesting here is stuff like Undead Blocks, which is a sort of a, a, which is a blockchain shooter game. Um, so this is not live yet. They're saying it is live, but um, I don't think there's anything to uh, do here. No download or anything. Um, but it could obviously... Uh, in typical sense, add it to my wish list when that one comes out. I did actually, I have actually downloaded a few. Well, so there's a few games I was messing around with, I've not actually installed them. So, again, like Steam, you sort of um, uh, have to sort of install the game. Um, uh, these are uh, blockchain based trading card games. So, um, yeah, I was just messing around with those. So, so these were free, um, it's a beta version. Um, but if I want to download it, obviously. Um, I can do so. So anyway, there we go with Ultra. Keep an eye on what's going on with that. Certainly there are a lot of new games um, that they've sort of been highlighting, uh, blockchain games, um, that'd be worth sort of checking out. Um, and I just think it'll be a slow burn. So, um, But if you, uh, yeah, if you get onto it now, you'll get a, you'll get your NFT. Um, and, uh, <laughs> um, yeah, there you go. That's what's going on. Okay. Um, thanks for watching the video. See you again soon.